Welcome to our FB page na Free Reviewers Managed by Leonalyn. Sa previous na video, na-explain na natin ito. Now, isa ka ba sa nagkakamali kung paano ito sagutan or paano natin i-follow ang order of operations? Ano nga ba ang order of operations? Ano nga ba itong MDAS? PEMDAS? Bakit ba maraming nagkakamali nito? Dati pa, since 2017, lagi na ako nagpo-post na mga ganito, MDAS. Hindi dito sa FB page na ito, kasi bago lang ito. Lagi kong itong pinopost sa FB group. At marami na rin tayong mga videos nito. Pwede nyong i-search. MDAS, tapos idugtong yung Leonalyn para madaling ma-sort out yung mga dati na nating na-upload. Mas magandang panuorin nyo yun para hindi nyo na makalimutan ang order of operations. Now, ang tamang sagot dito sa una ay 11, letter C. Kung ang sagot nyo ay 12 at 3, please lang i-review nyo ang order of operations. Dito naman sa pangalawa, although may video na tayo na ang tamang sagot dito ay 9, kung ang sagot nyo ay 5, 13 at 17, importante talagang i-review nyo kung paano i-follow yung order of operations, yung MDAS or yung PEMDAS. Magbasa muna tayo. BODMAS, PEMDAS. Ang PEMDAS, itong acronyms na ito, brackets or parentheses. Yan ang first step, second step. Orders or exponents, yan ang second. Ang pangatlo, di pa pareho yung kulay green na yan? Pareho sila. Multiplication at division, they rank equally, kaya we will solve them from left to right. Next, addition and subtraction. Parehong orange, addition and subtraction. They rank equally, kaya we will solve them whichever comes first sa mismong given from left to right. Gayon dito tayo sa grade 4 textbook. Sulat natin, galing ito sa grade 4. Doon muna tayo sa multiplication. Which one is correct? Ito yung given. 64 divided by 8 times 4 divided by 2. Sa letter A ba, na inuna yung multiplication bago yung mga division? Sa letter B ba, na ang ginawa dito ay left to right? Or itong letter C, na baliktad inuna yung nasa right bago yung left? Ang nandito sa libro sa grade 4 textbook, since there is only, only multiplication and division in the number sentence, we work from left to right. Right. Thus, the correct answer is B. Ito yung left to right. So, unahin natin si division bago si multiplication bago si division ulit. In cases where addition, basahin natin itong nasa last part. In cases where addition or subtraction is combined with multiplication or division, work from left to right pa rin. Pero, unahin pa rin si multiplication or division bago yung addition or subtraction. Now, dito naman tayo sa addition at subtraction. Grade 4 pa rin ang libro na ito. Which of the answers is correct? Ang given dito, ang problem ay 84 minus 25 plus 13 minus 7. Ang choice A ay left to right. Left to right. Ang choice B ay unahin si addition bago yung mga subtraction. Si choice C, baliktad. Right going to left. Basahin natin yung sagot. To make sure we will all arrive at the same answer, the order of operations was agreed upon. Kaya mayroon tayong order of operations para pareho daw yung sagot natin. Since there is only addition and subtraction in the number sentence, we work from left to right. Thus, the correct answer ay ito daw, letter A, left to right. 
na unahin yung subtraction bago yung addition and then yung subtraction ulit left to right marami pa tayong mga references galing sa grade 5 ito galing sa grade 6 ito ay elementary algebra basahin muna natin itong study.com kasi mas mas klaro ito step number 3 na tayo even though M for multiplication in PEMDAS comes before D for division, these two operations actually have the same priority. Sa Tagalog, kahit daw nauna itong M sa D sa acronym na PEMDAS, these two actually have the same priority. Kaya complete only those two operations in the order they occur. Ang Tagalog ng in the order they occur ay kung ano yung nasa given mismo. From left to right. Therefore, kung nauna si division kay ni multiplication, unahin si division. Kung nauna si multiplication kay ni division, unahin si multiplication. Basahin natin yung sa grade 5. Rule number 3. Multiply and divide in the order they appear from left to right. Sa grade 6, multiply or divide from left to right pa rin. Ito naman ay from algebra na libro. Multiply and divide from left to right. Now, do na tayo sa number 4. Step number 4, even though A for addition in PEMDAS comes before S. For subtraction, itong dalawa, these two operations also have the same priority. So, you look for these last two operations from left to right pa rin. Dito tayo sa grade 5, add and subtract in the order they appear from left to right pa rin. Sa grade 6, add or subtract from left to right pa rin. Ito naman sa algebra, step number 4, add and subtract from left to right. Isa pa. Ito naman ay ano ba tong reviewer na it, reviewer yata or ng libro ito. Step number 3, multiply and divide from left to right pa rin. Step number 4, add and subtract from left to right. Kung alin ang nauna. Next, dito tayo sa grade 7. Step number 3, perform all multiplication and division from left to right. Yung regarding sa left to right, Ito na may step number 4, mayroon pa ring left to right sa addition and subtraction. Huwag niyong kalimutan yung sa grade 4 textbook. Sa grade 4 textbook na left to right. Grade 4 textbook na left to right. Yan ang ibig sabihin ng left to right. So ngayon, Dito na tayo sa, nabasa na natin to study.com. Dito naman tayo sa reviewer civil service exam. MD means multiplication and division. These two operations actually have the same rank. Pariho lang daw siya. You should complete these two operations in the order they occur. From left to right. Depende sa given. AS then ganun din si addition and subtraction. Again, these two operations have the same rank. So, you should complete these two operations in the order they occur from left to right. So, yung pinaka-basic sa left to right ay itinuro sa grade 4 pa lang. Now, ito mas klaro, order of operations. Pagkatapos dito sa parenthesis, brackets, or groupings, meron tayong orders or exponents. Dito naman tayo sa step number 3 na multiplication and division they rank equally tapos ang pang-apat ay yung addition and subtraction they also rank equally kaya we will solve them from left to right kung alin ang mauna ganun din dito pariho lang yan sila left to right so i hope by this time gets niyo na kung bakit ang tamang sagot dito ay 11 at ito ay 9 so, para hindi na kayo malito next time, ganito na lang. Please, excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Na itong si my dear, pwede yang 
D or M, M or D, depende kung alin ang nauna from left to right. Ganun din si Aunt Sally, pwede siyang si A, S or S, A, kung alin ang nauna sa given left to right. Thank you and God bless.